Hey guys, Tech Timmy here. So today I am beyond excited, I would say, <laughs> maybe even borderline giddy to be doing this on this particular unboxing video for you because it is of the Sobro Smart side table slash nightstand. And I do intend to use this in my apartment here as a nightstand um, that also doubles as a fridge. It has a Bluetooth speaker. It has motion activated smart lights that basically turn on when you get out of bed at night so you can see what you're doing. And uh, did I mention the fridge? Um, <laughs> so it has a fridge and then also um, a fridge built into it. So I can put my spring waters or whatever else it is that I'm drinking, um, maybe a beer even, I don't know, um, at night uh, and put that, you know, essentially have that handy beside my bed. My bedroom is also my office, so it'd be nice to actually have be able to put some snacks and, and cold drinks and things in um, the in, in the fridge as well. So yeah, so I'm super stoked to get this out of the box. Also it has um, a Bluetooth speaker. I think I might have said already as well, and then um, wireless charging stations, and then some USB ports and, and other cool things that. Um, and I'm forgetting something, I think, but it's got a whole bunch of things going on with it. And my understanding is that the Bluetooth speaker actually sounds decent compared to some of these other. I actually bought a, um, I have another smart table that I put beside my couch that has a built-in Bluetooth speaker with it. Um, I'll actually include a link down in the, in the description to the unboxing video that I did of that table. The Bluetooth speaker in that, in that one just sounds all right, which is par for the course, I think, when you have Bluetooth uh, speakers added into furniture. So yeah, so with, without further ado, we're gonna get this out of the box. I have my um, Epic unboxing knife on standby here. It looks like I am going to need to use it. Uh, just a couple of quick notes. So I do notice that the packaging here with these sort of straps did do some damage to the box. So I'm hoping that that does not translate into the inside of this thing at all. Um, yeah, I've seen some other unboxing videos on YouTube for this that are a little strange um, in terms of the approach. So hopefully this is somewhat helpful for someone that, that, that is interested in buying this. Um, I did get the black one. I, I believe this also comes in white. So let's hope we have the black one in here. And yeah, those straps are pretty pretty solid, but no, no match for uh, Tech Timmy's unboxing knife here. So I'm gonna set that aside for just a second and we'll see. I'm gonna try and figure out the best way to get this out of the box. It looks like this is actually packaged up really good. Um, it does say, I do have it. So I don't know if you can see, but it does say this side up. So I do have it the, the face in the right way. Interestingly, there's handles on the bottom. Um, if I was the UPS guy, I would not be thrilled about having to deliver this because this is this is very heavy. Um, so how to open the box is the question. Probably should have looked at that first. But I wonder even if maybe you open it to the bottom and then the top slides off. So I'm going to just take a quick look at the bottom of the box. Again, this is this is this is pretty heavy. So bear with me here. Um, yeah, no, it looks like, so we have staples on the side, um, and that looks like it, that may be the best, oh, I'm already huffing and puffing, sorry. Um, again, super excited to get this out of the box, but, so I'm just going to rip, try and rip the box where the staples are here. I have no intention of sending this back, so, um, the reviews that I've read have all been stellar, so I am going to just go ahead and rip the box here. Why not? Like the animal that I am. <laughs> so this is going to be... Probably one of the most inelegant unboxing that you've seen due to the ripping, but hey, we're excited, like I said. So let's get the silver on the box here, and that went a little bit more smoothly. And interestingly, this looks like I did pick the right side to, to peel off here. So we have some more staples, some more staples inside. And then yeah, so well packaged. Um, it does not look like where the box got ripped did any damage to anything inside here. Styrofoam goes down all the way, so that's great. Um, looks like they did a great job packaging it actually. So I'm gonna try and get the styrofoam out of the way here next. Um, we're just gonna whoop, throw that aside. Put it out as well. And, that. and then yeah, like I said, this is not gonna be an elegant un unboxing. And you know, I almost wonder if it would make more sense to try and slide it out. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna try that. And I'm gonna be careful because I have a bad, somewhat of a bad back here. But 
Hey, heck, we're gonna get this out of the box for you in the next few minutes here for sure. So I'm putting it on its side, and I'm going to attempt, attempt to slide the whole thing out of the box here. Come on. I almost wonder if those handles on the side will allow me to... Hmm. It's heavy, all right. You know, I'm gonna rip more cardboard. Sorry guys, just bear with me here. I think if I just rip the cardboard, that's probably the easiest way to do it, so. There's the Sobro logo. Um, so maybe we're getting there. Um, and yeah, so Diana gonna look at the top of this thing. So let me see if I can take the just trying to get this in the center of the center of the uh, camera for you. And then, yeah, okay, so this just this comes off. So you're ready for the big reveal? Here we go. Dun, dun, dun. Hey, all right. So it is the black one. So you got the right color, which is great. I'm sitting inside the piece of large piece of styrofoam there. And then we can't get this off. That's a couple. Oh wow. Oh I love the color's got a little bit of a the top's got a little bit of a gradient to it. I love the look of it. Absolutely love the look of it. Very modern looking. This is gonna look awesome beside my bed. And I have some other black furniture in the bedroom, so. This is going to go well, perfectly. I'm going to take it with this piece of styrofoam and get it out of the way. And then I'm going to, you know, let me see if I can. <clears throat> so is this, so now that I look at it, this is not the top, can't be. Um, so, well, yeah, yeah, it is the top. Um, so it says, for a quick and helpful video on setting up your Sobro smart side table and all of its features, follow the QR code above. So. Um, so this, let's turn this around for you, so this, and there goes the rest of the box, cool, let's get that right out of the picture. Um, so this little QR code here, you basically scan with your cell phone um, camera app, and it will show you a video in terms of how to set it up. So I'm going to do that in a little bit, but we're going to take a look at this anyway, as is, now that, now that we have it out of the box. And I do wonder if there's a piece of, yeah, so there's a plastic outer wrapping, covering the top. And that's actually gonna get rid of the gradient, which is too bad, because I, I really like the look of that. But it's a very smooth, um, so, yeah, there's a little, I don't know if you can see it, a little rubber thing. So this is a bumper, I'm guessing. And I'm gonna just set that aside for now, because I'm guessing that needs to go back on. But we're gonna take, we're gonna take the, the plastic wrap off here, which is being a little bit stubborn. Just to show you that. See the top here. Jeez, yeah, they really did a great job packaging this up. Um, so I don't want to lose the QR code, so I'm going to carefully do it. And then set that aside. Oh, there we go. So I am going to just set this aside for now. And I'm going to watch that video in a little bit. And I suggest that it's not really easy to do the same. Um, and there, so there is the, so a little bit of fingerprinting action, well, but not really, so it's actually, withstand, my, I have oily hands, <laughs> um, so it actually withstands that fairly well, um, the, let's get it completely unwrapped here, so I'm just going to turn it on the side, it's going to actually fall on the styrofoam, so that's okay, and then, oh, wait, okay. So, I'm going to get the plastic out of the equation completely here. And then, yeah, so bear with me while I get this box out of your way. And then we'll be looking at nothing but the table itself. So, out of the box, I mean, there's a lot of styrofoam packaging here, so it's not as heavy for sure. Um, it's definitely easy to sort of maneuver and toss around here. So, all right, so I'll tell you what, I've got a little bit that I know about it. Well, I mean, I did do my homework. This is not a cheap product. In fact, this is a this is a real treat for me. So uh, I do a lot of videos about smart home technology on my channel, 
And this is something that I had actually saw the main larger size coffee table version that Sobo has as a two drawer fridge. Actually, I think this has two drawers as well, but it's just larger and it's more like a coffee table that you set in front of your couch. That, that came out years ago. And I really have I've wanted that ever since. And then I actually, I bought a nice coffee table for my, for my crib here, a non-smart one. So that, that I absolutely love. And it's got a <laughs> TMI, but it's got a, the top of it actually flaps up, lifts up so I can use it as a, as a table and I eat there often. So getting that larger coffee table was overkill for me, but I thought, what a great idea for a bed stand if they ever made one. And sure enough, um, they came out with this a while back and I've had my sights on it ever since. So pretty cool. So here, this is the, um, the charging dock, wireless charging dock. So you can basically sit your cell phone on top of that or your tablet or whatever, and it will charge, um, it'll charge automatically. Super cool. And particularly knowing that I you know, generally set my phone down at night on my, night, my current dumb nightstand that it will charge, charge my phone up automatically that way. So that's pretty cool. And then I'm going to tip this over. So on the bottom, um, well, do I want to go there? Yeah, I guess we can, all right. So I'm going to show you the bottom next, I'm holding the doors in place. So here is the light that I mentioned, the smart light. Um, my understanding is that this is motion activated and will actually um, go off if it detects motion. Um, which were, which is could, could be cause a really cool effect, um, particularly you know getting out of bed at night. At least I think think oh, this may just be the mood light, but I know that there's also one that will when you walk by, light up. Um, so when you get out of bed, essentially, a little bit of uh, a, you know the, the light will illuminate. I think you can set the colors and everything else. Um, these things here are for feet or for the feet of the unit, I presume. Although it's interesting that, no, I'm wrong. So this is actually, this is the back. No, this is, yeah. So this is the back. This is not the part that sits on the floor. So this is the back of the unit. And then I think that that, that is a mood light. And then these knobby things, I'm not really sure what they do. Um, and the, the rubber one that I have does not fit on there. So we'll take a look at that. I suspect the parts are actually in the fridge. Um, we'll take a look at that in a second as well. So yeah, so this is obviously the back. We're just looking at the top and now I'll flip it over and we'll take a look at the bottom. Um, so the bottom is where the legs go. Um, so this could potentially sit on the floor, I suppose, but uh, the current nightstand that I have is, is up high. And my understanding is there's two different sets of legs. You get low ones and then higher ones. I'm definitely gonna use the higher ones because I, I, I do like to have my, my, my nightstand up, up, up as high as it can go. Um, so this is the bottom. And the legs will, will, will screw into the air. Um, place for the power cord, which again, hopefully is, is inside the fridge because I'm not seeing any other, any other parts of the box. So gotta be. Um, so yeah, so next, and I, oh, I think this is actually the, gotta be the, the, the smart light that turns on uh, when you get out of bed. So super cool. I think that one in the back, I think is just for mood lighting. And then here, so the front of the unit, is obviously, so this is the um, this is the fridge. I'm gonna let me turn it around this way because I'm gonna flip the video when I, when I actually publish it. So, okay, and then more plastic. So let's put that off. So we can look at, the, at the fridge doors together here. Um, about plastic, and again, you gotta have that nice matte. It's not shiny. It's like more like a matte black finish, and it just looks very elegant and modern. I absolutely love it. And then here, um, so we have, aha! So here we have our parts, uh, presumably the power cord, or maybe the, well, we'll see. Let's, let's open it up, Tim. <laughs> if you can't tell, I'm, this is, I'm just super, super stoked over this. Again, well packaged. Um, we've got the Sober logo there. Uh, looks, looks actually super cool. And then a um, nice little box. And then, yeah, again, and wow, what a nice job they did. And then there we go. So. Um, I guess I'm not going to have to save that paper after all because we have another um, the QR code they actually put inside the box as well, which is a nice touch. Love that um, documentation. Um, and then, oh, so this is this is the knobby thing or one of them um, for whatever that dial is that we saw. So maybe that's volume oh, dimmers. Interesting. So this probably controls if they're dimmers, it controls the lighting. So it says dimmer on it, and so it says attach both dimmers to the back of the showroom to control the backlight from either side. How cool is that? 
Uh, so yeah, I have a backlight on my nightstand. I love it. Uh, yeah, so the documentation looks solid. Get started unpack and assemble the table, parts and accessories in the box, connect Bluetooth with the instructions. I mean, it's so cool. And then, okay, so a well, uh, you know, complete set of documentation here. Um, it looks really well done. If you subscribe to my channel, you probably know that I'm, I'm a technical writer by trade. So my day job is, is I, I do technical writing and uh, I, I produce all sorts of manuals like this, but this one looks very, very well done. I, I think there might even be a clock with this. Let me just see. So parts and features, I'm trying to see, I'm trying to get to the packing list here. Um, okay, so we have, so it's a dual wireless charging patch. You can actually charge two devices at one time. That space in the middle in the front is, um, is actually a storage shelf with also cable management. So that's great. So we can hide, hide the cables. The speakers are um, actually here. <laughs> so let's get, so obviously let's just, go, let's get through the box. Then we, then we can take a closer look. I'm gonna set this aside for a second. And then we can talk about the front of the unit um, right after that. And then, so here are the feet. Um, I thought there were two different sizes, but maybe the company changed that up. These look, um, these look tall enough for me. So this is gonna give you a know, decent height for beside the bed, um, which I love that. Grab it as opposed to sitting it on the floor, as I had said. So two dimmers, um, and we will actually pop, pop these on the, on the unit in a second just to show you that, give you the full experience. And then here we have, um, obviously, the, so this is the power cord. And then we also have, it looks like a, so we have a male to male Bluetooth, maybe uh, auxiliary um, sort of wire. So great there. And then I'm just gonna lift this up, just make sure there's nothing under it. And there's not. So one set of feet, maybe there's a second set that we can get from the manufacturer, I'm not really sure. Others that I've seen unbox this have had two sets of feet. So that could just be a change that the company made, um, which is, these seem perfect for me. So I'm okay with the, with the size of the feet. And I'm just gonna close this up. Actually, I'm just gonna set it aside without closing it up. And then, yeah, so um, just to take a quick look at the front of the unit, so fridge, and I think it's either, I think you can use one of them as storage as well. And then this is, the, is what they call a storage area and cable management. And then Bluetooth speakers are here. Um, and it seems very well solid. This thing is just super well put together. I'm, I'm super impressed. I love it, I absolutely love it. Um, so neat, and then I'm gonna try and maybe I'll, yeah, let me, let me position this down just like the drawers. And it looks like on the top, I have a little bit of extra plastic. I'll get that off after. Um, I think that might be, this, this slot in the back might have something to do with cable management as well. Yeah, so cable management, the cord keeper, it says on the instructions, and then the charging pad. So that's essentially basically all that we have on the top of the unit. And then here, I'm going to actually, let's maybe do side view with the, with the drawers. We're gonna open the drawers next. And then, <laughs> oh wow, okay. Yeah, so this is so these are the refrigerator, refrigerator drawers, um, and it's much different than what I pictured. They just look like empty desk drawers essentially. So it'll be interesting to see how how well this cools. And I'm not really sure, but I will find out, and I'll I'll, I'll, I'll put something in the description about it. If both or just one act as a fridge, um, but they do. Yeah. So oh wow, and, and actually. It, 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 once you get it to the end, it'll actually move itself. Watch, it'll actually take itself all the way home here. Let me just, how cool is that? Um, so just super well thought out product. And I, I just can't wait to get this set up beside my bed. I think I'm gonna buy a nice sorta, I'm gonna buy a nice lamp for it. Um, there is a clock, I think that the company manufactures as well. Um, that I thought might be included. Maybe, maybe they did away with that as well, as well as the second set of, of feet. If I find them, I will, as I said, I will update the, I will put something in the description as well. And here we go with my excited sweaty hands getting fingerprints all over this thing already. Um, but yeah, I know it's, uh, it's cool, way cooler than I, than I expected actually. So I'm just gonna turn it on the side here and we'll, we'll wrap this up. And yeah, um, so there you have it, the Sobro. Smart side slash side table slash bed uh, bed bed stand. 
Um, <laughs> as you, if you can't already tell, I'm just I'm just super stoked about this, and I look forward to getting it out of the box. Hopefully, you found this unboxing video somewhat helpful. If you did, if you wouldn't mind, just give me a quick thumbs up. It really helps out my YouTube channel a lot and tells YouTube that this was a good video and hopefully YouTube will show it to more people and hopefully it will help them out as well. And then if you are into smart home technology like the Sobro side table slash bed stand, uh, consider sub subscribing to my channel if you would. I do all sorts of videos on tons of smart home tech. I have a huge pile of stuff that I bought on Amazon Prime Day this year, still waiting to come out of the box, including a bunch of Echo speakers, uh, um, a cool robot window washer and some other things. So yeah, please subscribe and um, we'll see you in the next one. Hope you found this helpful. Tech Timmy signing off. I'm gonna go set my uh, bed stand up beside my table. <laughs> my, my bed stand up beside my bed. Peace.